Hey, it's Monday, and this marks my eighth video in eight days. Uh, that's actually pretty incredible for me, considering the amount of editing and time I put in these videos and doing it with a work schedule and everything. Uh, it also means I have, counting today, four days left at my current job. So the countdown's still on. Um, I think Friday, uh, YouTube becomes my career, at least for two weeks. Uh, then I'll start looking for a job. I, I wanted to um, uh, take two weeks off because I haven't had a vacation in like seven years. And then I'll hit it again and look for another job. So, today it's been hotter than blazes and I haven't been able to really do much on the bikes. It's just too darn hot. It was like 105 today. And by the time I got everything done this morning, I just could not function in that heat. So I really didn't do anything vlog-wise today. That's why I'm doing this talking head video. I'm also sitting at 982 subscribers and I wanted to thank everybody for subscribing and supporting the channel and commenting and everything. And uh, I know Jeff quit playing with drones and get on the 1100. <laughs> I know what you're thinking. The other thing I saw this week was uh, Kim's pinstriping on his wheels on his Goldwing. Um, I'll put a link to the video below. Uh, they came out really cool. Uh, I can't say enough about it. He's been one of my subscribers for a while. And uh, those wheels look really trick with the Goldwing logos and the red pin striping. Uh, I'd like to do something similar, but uh, you won't see it on my bike because of everything's so covered on it. On the drone video, that was kind of something I did for our little group. Um, it was one of the kids' birthdays, and they had water balloons, and I have a drone with a payload drop, so we figured we'd try it and see if we could drop a, a balloon. Uh, the first one didn't go so well. The balloon started leaking, so I had to get rid of it because I can't land it with the balloon on it. I have to actually get rid of it. And then somebody had to move some cars around, so I got stuck hovering above the field. And then the second one, it got a little unwieldy. It's right at the payload limit for the drone. And I couldn't really drop it on the kids like I'd wanted to, but I think I, could, I, think I salvaged it pretty well. Uh, I hope everybody enjoyed it. I had a lot of fun doing it. Uh, it was a pretty challenging editing project. It was a pretty challenging editing project. There was over 40 clips from three different cameras that I used. And the minute's got like 3 minute 29 second runtime. So it was some pretty intense editing. It took me about six hours to edit it all together by the time I found music. I took the clips off the cameras, figured out what I wanted to do. And again, I was kind of salvaging because it didn't come out the way I wanted it to, but I think it works. 